everyone, it's Alexis, and I am here with a really quick haul video from from Ulta. Um, I literally just got back from there, like set up my camera and plopped down and wanted to show you guys because I got so excited. So I went to Ulta originally looking for the Zoya Pixie Dust Nail Polishes for their summer collection, which they totally don't have. I can't find them at all in my area, and I really don't want to order them online. Like, I prefer to see nail polish in person, but whatever. But what I did find while I was there was they're carrying some new stuff. And in all of that new stuff is Envy, that's how I'm going to say it, or Envy, I guess you could say it, but Envy Echo, or Envy Eco however you want to say it, personal, personal choice, um, but they are carrying that, and they're, so I was like walking to the register, and it was like a shining beacon on the side on my way up to the register, like they have all sorts of fun stuff to play with, um, and I got so excited, and if finances allowed me, I probably would have came home with a lot more than what I did, uh, but I think I'll probably have the collection soon before they decide that they're not carrying it, because I find with Ulta, anytime I fall in love with a brand or get really excited about it, like in the next three months it's gone and I'm like, great, awesome, nice to know you. So anyways, on with the show and tell. So I picked up, um, I don't really need any foundations, although those were very intriguing to me, but what I found was two eyeshadows and two mascaras. Um, and so, let's just show you. So I picked up the shade 168, which I think this one was the one that said it was rose gold or something like that. And it's not really what I would call a traditional rose gold. It's, it's a very nice kind of, I don't even know if it'll show up in the camera, but it's, um, a very nice muted skin tone gold and it has just the perfect amount of shimmer and I'm sorry if you can hear bottle rockets in the background it's almost the 4th of July and my neighborhood is excited um, so the pigmentation ooh, all sorts of fingers everywhere but the pigmentation you can see is really really pretty um, for me this is very much the color of my skin tone like when I swatch it I'll try to watch it. You can see that's the other one that's like, still left on my skin. And yeah, that, so it disappears, but it leaves behind like just the prettiest shimmery gold tone on the eyelid. So that was shade 168. And then I picked up shade 170. And this is called Black Gold. And this I thought was really um, kind of a unique shadow. It's kind of charcoal-y, kind of black, kind of green, kind of gray, with um, shot through with some gold sparkle. And I just thought that this would be really pretty for a, um, a summer, like, smoky eye. You can see, again, totally awesome pigmentation. And then that's it, kind of swatched out. It's really pretty. It's very, it's a softer black, which I find that for summer, like when you wear a really stark black, it can look um, a little heavy for this time of year. So then I got two of their mascaras and I picked up the, I don't know if they have more than one type, but this is the Volumizing Mascara Enriched with Organic Jojoba and Lethicin. And I picked up black because my trusty Physicians Formula False Effect Shiny Pink Tube organic stuff is almost out. Um, and I thought, well, why not? Let's just see what this does. And so that is that. The brush is kind of a cool shape. The packaging is a really nice kind of um, a matte finish packaging. It feels really cool. So I got that. The one I was really excited about and I just was like, why do I need this? 
I don't know, but I needed it. And it's so flipping amazing that I can't even get it out of the package. I'm so excited. Um, anyways, so again, same packaging, and this is in blue. Now, normally when you find blue mascara, it's like navy, not like, especially in a natural mascara, it's not like, oh my god, blue. So, I was really excited with this. Because this is, <laughs> you can see it already, this is Oh My God Blue, which I think is like awesome for summer. Um, you can use it to tip the lashes, you can put it on the lower lashes, but it's just like, holy, holy cow, look at all that pigmentation. Like, it's just so gorgeous. I just couldn't, couldn't get over my excitement. So that's what I found, and I was really excited. They had some really nice looking lipsticks, some like nude shades that I thought looked really pretty. Um, they had some nice glosses, but I'm not a huge gloss wearer, so those are like, eh, for me. Um, and then they had the foundation shade, foundation range in the cream compact, which looked very intriguing. So I may have to check that out um, as we head towards some drier months in the near future. So that is all. That is my haul. So I hope you enjoyed it. I'm really excited to find something so cool at Ulta that I'm like over the moon. Like I could shout it to the rooftops. So <laughs> I hope you guys have a great day and that you enjoyed this. And if you did or if you think there's something I should check out from NV Echo or N... Yeah, that's how I'm going with it. NV Echo. Um, put it in the down bar below and I will check it out and talk to you later. So Take care. Bye.